Hello friends, welcome back to our YouTube channel Nesting Padasali. So this video will be really helpful if you are a gate aspirants who are going to write the examination under this biotechnology paper. So without any delay, let's get into the video. So this video will be really helpful. So please watch the video fully so that uh, you can thank me later because watching this video will be really helpful at the point of writing your examination in the in front of your system or computer in the examination. So without any delay, let's get into the video. So once you have provided your login details, this is how the question paper will be. I'm not entering into the question paper, uh, every dashboard things and all in this particular video. I'm going to share the strategy which I followed that makes me to clear this gate examination. I not to, I, I didn't clear my gate examination in the first attempt. After two to three attempts only, I had cleared this gate examination. So I'm the right person to provide you the details that you can also follow and you can learn from my mistake. So once you had got this particular window has been opened, don't ever look or don't ever try to solve this general attitude question center. Don't even read the questions, okay? Don't waste your time in reading the question. In the last part of the video, I had provided you the my time management skill. If that, that uh, that's fine, good for you, you too can follow my time management skill. So please click this particular window. So by clicking general attitude, you will get general attitude type of question and by clicking uh, BT, you will get our biotechnology paper. So what is the reason why I'm saying to first select this BT means you once you had entered into exam hall and once you sit in before your system, definitely your mind will be fresh. At that time, if you keep on clicking this biotechnology paper, it will be very much easy for you to clear this gate examination because General aptitude with respect to gate exam, it is really a tough thing. So that's the reason biotechnology I'm asking you to put first. Okay. So first thing is that uh, don't look this question central first. Okay. Better uh, for the first 10 minutes, you can keep on glancing the question paper. Just try to read. If you find problems like over here, please don't try to solve this problem at the first uh, one to two hours of the time period. Okay, even though if you are a BTEC biotechnology graduate, please don't select problem center. So, first just give a glance of all those questions. Okay, okay. So, then go to question number one and start to solve as I'm going to say. So, say with this particular question, you should say you should always see over here this is the pink color question type. What is the question type? Whether it is a MCQ or MSQ or MEAT. MCQ means multiple choice question. So, out of four options, only one option will be correct. And the next quest type of question is MSQ type of question. MSQ type of questions means what? The answers will be one or more than one type of questions. I, I don't want to explain you all about it. If you want to read the instruction by clicking view instructions over here, you can try to click this particular view instruction. So here they had given you this MSQ type of question. You'll also have four choices. Okay, out of the four choices, one choice or more than one choice is or correct. Okay, and you need to consider all the choice and determine the correct answer. Okay, <clears throat> so I'll just uh, uh, inform you when whenever we solve MSQ type of question. So if you know the correct option for this particular question, then please click the correct option. And you should click here, save and next. Okay, this green color means, uh, for student side, I can say this green color means you are 100% confident and this question will definitely add up your mark. So, here the mark for correct answer is 1 mark and the negative mark is also given. That is 1 by 3 mark will be, <coughs> sorry, will be detected. Okay, so you are giving a correct option one mark. So immediately after giving this green color mark, you are sure about the answer. Take a scribbling pad and put the question number as one and put the question type at MCQ and put the mark as one. Whenever you are coming uh, coming across a correct option, always try to update all those. So have a separate page in your scribbling pad or rough notebook or a paper that is given for you. Anyway, you will throw your paper the drop. Uh, you, you can't able to carry the scribbling pad with you. You need to left them in the exam hall itself. But then you can able to uh, carry with them. Okay. So that you can give a rough idea. So yesterday I had uploaded a video. Safest mark of uh, scoring or clearing gate biotechnology paper. So after you clear, uh, after you had done this question. Then you need to click save and next. 
next type of question if you don't know just click save and next or you can drag this particular option so this question is msq type of question and my personal suggestion is that try to uh, give answer as much as for this msq type of question and net type of question that is numerical answering type of question the main reason is that if the attempted question is correct means you will get two more okay but if the attempted question is wrong, you won't reduce any mark. That is no negative marking for the MSQ type of question. Okay, if you had attempted the correct option, you will get two mark. Or else if you had attempted the question is wrong, the no mark will be reduced from the total mark. Okay, so MSQ type of question means here they are asking which of the following antimicrobial agent is or are growth factor analog. Okay, so you need to select what are the antimicrobial agent you get. Okay, so you can select one option or more than one option. Whereas if you take this M is, uh, sorry, MCQ type of question, here you will have round arrow mark whereas in MSQ type of question that is question number 3 here you are having the square arrow mark and also in this particular MCQ type of question you can able to select only one option only so here you can able to see if you are selecting apoptosis only apoptosis will be shown but you can select pinocytosis means only one option will be there whereas if you select this MSQ type of question you can select all the options so this is the thing so it is a square answering type and that one particular is a uh, circle type of thing so this is a msq type of question okay so if you are sure about this particular option you can click save and next okay so the next problems just leave and next question this is also a problem uh, next question is uh, this this is also if you don't know whether it is a biotechnology problem already you have worked with this problem by watching any youtube video or in your colleges they had taught you many things mean Try to attempt this question or else if you if you are coming across the problematic question for which you know the formula or you know how to do means just click mark for review and next. Okay, mark for review and next. Okay, so the violet color uh, circle is marked for review and next. Okay, this question you know the answer but since it is a problem type of question you want to review it later. Okay, likewise you should select all these things. Okay, so if you select this type of question, you know the answer but you are 75 percentage only confident. In that circumstances, please click the correct option and use this particular dashboard. That is mark for review and next. You know the option and you are only 75 percentage you are saying that option is correct. Remaining 25 percentage you are still in a confusionary mode. Okay, since it is a MCQ type of question, marks for correct answer is one mark, whereas this also holds a negative mark. So, at that time, please select this particular option that is mark for review and next. Here you can be able to see mark for review. So, you have given your uh, answer that is uh, can select question number 8 in question number 8 you have selected the option but you are having a confusion that's the reason after selecting the option you need to click mark for review but here if you take question number 6 this is a problematic type of question and you are only 20 to 50 percentage confident level that's the reason you you not even given a right option you don't even answer the question and simply you are giving mark for review and next. Okay. So, while evaluation of your question paper by IIT Karakur authorities, they won't take this particular question for their final evaluation. Since you didn't provide an answer, they will select only this green color and this violet color circle that is answer. You have to answer the question and then you have to mark for review question. That's how they will take the option. Okay. Next thing. <coughs> So, likewise, you need to see which what is the type of question and what is the correct option like that you need to see. So, some questions will be very much easier. So, this type of question. So, even though if you are a MSc graduate or even though if you are a PhD graduate or even though if you are a BSc graduate, try to read the question thrice. Okay. So, which of the following statement is incorrect so many students by watching this particular thing they might found whether it is correct like they might uh, give a wrong option in that circumstances you should read whether it is incorrect or correct they are asking what is the question even though it is very easiest question try to read two twice or thrice because these question are trap question that have been given by iit karapur so please make sure you are reading the question twice or thrice okay so this is how the trapping will be okay so after you had attempted the question 
you 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 will be having everything over here okay so everything you can see in this particular thing itself so now i'll share with you tips and tricks that i had followed to clear this particular examination okay so here you can able to see so total time is 180 minutes that is 3 hours first 15 minutes it is you should give a glance of the question paper next 30 minutes sorry this is the excel paper uh, i'll show for gate bt paper total time is 180 minutes that is for 3 hours for the first 10 minutes please give a glance of question paper okay so by giving glance of question paper your mind will fix whether the question paper is easy or hard if the question paper is hard please don't lose heart because if the question paper is hard then cut off will be lower then many student who are in average level will clear this question exam okay so the, if the question paper is tough then average average study student like if you are studying around 30 to 15 mark 50 marks in a gate mock test then you will clear your examination next 45 minutes attempt question that are having 100 percentage confident like your questions will have this symbol that is answered symbol and marked and answer symbol that's only you should have so attempt question that you are having 100 percentage confident level so in 100 percentage of question paper nearly 30 to 40 percentage of questions will be very much easier and even though slow learners can attempt those questions and next 30 questions 30 minutes try to attempt problem so if you had already well known about the problem try to attempt the problem type of question okay in that 30 minutes don't please extend the time next 30 minutes okay uh, you need to finalize the question that you have answered and mark for question so in the question paper palette if you are having this violet color and green color circle means okay you need to convert and you need to finalize those question that you have kept answered as well as marked for review so this particular status should be changed to green color next 10 minutes you should calculate your marks in the scribbling pad so yesterday i had provided <coughs> details with regarding to minimum mark to qualify gate exam biotechnology paper so for general you should have you should get 40 to 50 mark if you are obc you should get 25 to 40 mark and if you are ac sc and person with disability you should have 15 to 30 mark as your safe zone so you should calculate all the marks at the first starting itself i have mentioned you whenever you are giving a correct answer the scribbling mark you should put one mark two mark like that at the last after 30 minutes of time period so after 80 uh, 85 minutes you should find you should calculate your marks the scribbling pad so say after calculating you are getting 50 marks means please stop at that time point itself and please sit simply without watching your question paper palette or just sleep in your thing itself please don't look the question paper what your mind will think your mind will critically think and it will make you to give a wrong answer or it will make you to change the correct answer to wrong answer so that's the reason or else if you are calculating a mark you are still getting the 25 marks or 30 marks that's a border mark say in general means you are, if you are getting 50 marks that's well and good instead of 50 mark if you are getting 40 marks that's a border level okay still a uh, only 80 percentage of chances to clear gate examination at that time point try to answer question with 75 percentage of confidence level this question signifies marked for review status so while you are attempting your question paper you will have some question that you are simply you will put a mark mark for review mark for review you you won't be <coughs> answering those questions and all so here question number 6 you had given it for marked for review and other questions i can say so these type of question you can mark it for review uh, so um, one second so this violet color uh, so take this question this question you didn't answer the question but anyway you had studied somewhere in your college days means please don't select answer just click mark for review if you had selected the answer then the iit karakpur will take the question as an answer and they will uh, give a negative mark if the answer that was given by you is wrong okay in that circumstances you should always review what are the question that are marked for review and you should think wisely and you should give a correct options only or else please don't attempt this question so this is how you need to prepare or you need to write for your gate biotechnology paper thank you